the news of the release and return of 82 of the 2014 kidnapped Chibok school girls brought up to many parents of the captured girls and was heartwarming to many Nigerians. However, parents of these girls are said to be waiting in anxiety to reunite with their daughters who have been under the oppression of the Islamic sect Boko Haram for over three years. This was revealed by the chairman of the Chiba community in Abuja. Some of them we were in touch, even the one, especially the one that have not been released. If I can remember one person that called me now up to ten times asking that he was even uh, saying that uh, even if his uh, daughter's name is not there, he wished to come so that he will see them and prove that yes, the daughter is not there. Look at the type of anxiety that parents are having. A strategic member of the Bring Back Our Guest campaign, Iman Shewu, also revealed that one of the parents of these girls in Abuja also identified her daughter's name on the list of the released 82 girls. Yeah, Rebecca Samuel Younger, who virtually is, um, has become the poster face of the anguish of the parents because she had to relocate with her husband and the other children to Abuja. And um, after the, 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 the return of the girls on Sunday, and the list came out on Monday morning. Uh, it turned out that her daughter's name is on the list. So that, that um, has been a very momentous moment for the younger family. Regarding some comment by few individuals that the entire Chibok girls who were captured in 2014 is a scam, Iman Shewu and the chairman of the Chibok community in Abuja both cleared the air. President Jonathan himself, because unfortunately most of the people who are making um, a lot of these negative statements are people who were sympathetic to the previous administration and therefore they feel that this thing happened because it was something that was done to get um, Jonathan out of power. So the first point is if Jonathan who was the commander in chief was so weak with all the apparatus of power that he had that people outside the corridors of power could organize something like this to destabilize him and eventually get him out of power. Then it showed that he was not competent enough to even have been the commander-in-chief. Those people, uh, whatsoever you do, they will never agree to what you say and what you do. Uh, as, uh, as you know, uh, since the time immemorial, people have been telling us that there is God. But yet now you will get some people who will say that there is no God. So what will you do? Will you force them to believe? No. So let them stay with their unbelief, with their doubt. However, the versions given to the entire story of the captured Chibok girls, no doubt friends and families of these girls cannot wait with so much anticipation to reunite with their daughters. Austin Peacemaker, PTV News.